Welcome everyone again to Back Into Fishing. I'm here today at the Soccerplex. It's been a little light fishing here lately. I haven't really got anything of size and not anything in great numbers. I'm hoping today I can uh, at least hook up with something. I'm really here early in the morning. For me anyway, it's before 8 o'clock. It's cold, it's about 52, 53 degrees. I don't know what the water temperature is when I can get to it. I'll get a temperature reading, but hopefully we can come out of here today with something. Well, I think I'll do something different today. I'll just do like a highlights. I'll just feature the fish as I catch them and uh, see how that works out. Try something new. You know, one of the things I don't like about this place is all this vegetation growing on the top. It's really bad this year. It was bad this year and the last two years as well. But, I mean, it's like every cast, it's a rare cast that you make and you get your bait back in and it doesn't have that stuff all over it. But that's the price you pay to fish here. <sighs> well, finally a fish. About 10, 10 and a half inch. Not bad. He's warm. Definitely warmer than the air temperature is here. Where's a good place to throw him where the water's a little deeper over there? I don't think that's a bass. I don't know what that is. It is a bass. It's just a small one. I forgot. These small ones do hit funny here. I've never had that kind of hit anywhere else. Well, this is a Small one for the year, four, four and a half inches. I guess this doesn't really count, just a little bluegill, but. Just wanted to see if there were any of them swimming out here in the shallows. Here. Quit spinning. It's number three, yeah, about nine inch. And number four, that was only like two casts later. Maybe three, no more than that. Another nine, nine and a half incher. I cast into the drain pipe and there might actually be something in there. That's not the first time I've caught one out of that drain pipe. I think that's like the third fish. First one this year, but there could be another nine and a half inch one. on it, I think it was. Or maybe not. <clears throat> it must have came towards me. I don't think that's what jumped back in there. He's not all that big. He's not nine and a half. It might be ten and a half, but he's definitely not as big, I think, as what I heard jumping back here. So there might be another one over there. Make I think that's another fish. I just got situated here. The wind's blowing right at me, I can't really tell. <coughs> well, it was. <coughs> <coughs> I 
another ah, nine and a half inch one. At this point, as I keep saying, I'll take them. Let's do your four fish out of the spot. Again, he's. This one is not a keeper either, but he's getting up there. He's all tangled here. Well, I guess he's not. He's another 10 incher. Ten and a half. Line's moving. Launched him out of the water. And this as well. Feels like another small one. Not super small, but definitely not the smallest one of the day. They're probably only about five and a half. Okay, I don't know if I got that catch on camera or not. The camera's acting up, but I just got this guy on the other side of the fountain. Now that's fish of the year. I don't know. He's not all that big, but I haven't gotten one this big yet this year. As it just so happens, not that he's a giant by any means, but I happen to have my scale. Let's get a look here. And we got 1.46 pounds. Well, I I will definitely take this fish. It's the biggest one so far this year. Thank you, buddy, for visiting the channel. We'll let you go. Hopefully, we'll see you again soon. Another nine and a half incher. Well, the sun has come out. It's finally starting to really warm up. Uh, action started out slow. It was cold this morning. I was about ready to pack it in. And I started catching fish. Didn't feel cold all of a sudden. And you know, I totally lost track of how many I got. So just watch the video and you'll see. So thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.